Every Who down in Whoville liked Christmas a lot. But the Grinch, who lived just north of Whoville, did not. The Grinch hated Christmas, the whole Christmas season. Now, please don't ask why. No one quite knows the reason. It could be his head wasn't screwed on just right. It could be, perhaps, that his shoes were too tight. But I think that the most likely reason of all may have been that his heart was two sizes too small. Hmm. Tis the season of cheer, and Christmas is looming. But the Grinch isn't happy. In fact, he is fuming. With a hatred so deep that he just can't conceal it. To cancel this Christmas, old Grinchy will steal it. To get into town, to make it the distance, you'll need to find Max. You'll need his assistance. Slither and slink with a smile most unpleasant. To earn more rewards, collect every present. More hot than a chimney, more sweet than a nuzzle. It looks like you found Grinch, a piece of a puzzle. Collect all the pieces to unlock more skills. With brand new abilities come brand new thrills. In order to make his way into the town, old Grinchy needs Max to make the trek down. Ah. Hang and climb. Huh? Well done. Ha! Ah. Ah. Spiders turn Grinch from a grouch to a grump. You can either avoid them or nimbly jump. Look around. Ha! Mm -hmm. ha! Jingly ball is so big it could crush, turning Grinch to Grinch soup and Max into mush. Ha! Ha! Oh! Ha! Max is nearby and Grinchy can feel it. His tail wags reveal him. He just can't conceal it. Ha! 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 The door. Max must be nearby. Oh. If you stick to the trail, you can follow the sound of the wag of his tail. After searching through packages, boxes, and sacks, Finally, Grinch has found cute little Max. Reunited with Max, Grinch is feeling more brave. Together, the duo must trek through the cave. This door is locked shut. Hinges all glitch. Help Grinch and Max find the Sneaky Creek switch. To get on with the plot, to move on and explore, little dog Max can help open the door. There's a switch to unlock on this door's other side. But this trap door is so tiny, you'll need a small guide. The trap door is too small for old Grinch's round shape. But Max can wiggle right through without even a scrape. Switch between Grinch and Max. 
A now open pathway was closed just before. What a great Grinchy trick. You've opened the door. Now Grinch can continue. You're well on your way. The countdown is on to steal Christmas Day. <laughs> Keep going, old Grinch. You've got Christmas to take. You've got presents to steal. And who hearts to break? Push rocks! That rock can help you reach the ledge. <laughs> nice job, old Richie. <laughs> A cave full of secrets in crannies and nooks. You'll find hidden places you just need to look. Oh. Ha! Ha! There's stuff in the foreground. In the background, there's more. You can warp from the front to the back to explore. Ha! 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 Come back to the front. Ha. Time to get on your way. You've got work to do to steal Christmas Day. Ha. Jump on objects like rocks ha. to get even higher. Oh. Nice job, old Grinchy. Ha! Ha! Rump to old Christmas. To steal it is brave. To get on with the plan, get out of this cave. <laughs> on guard for that guard. Stay out of its way. The Grinch hates how these wooden nutcrackers play. Oh. Ha! 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 Ah. Ha! 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 See how these nutcrackers grin? How they gawk? Try hmm? rolling them over with a roly-pole rock. Oh. Oh. Ha. Huh. Ha. Ha. Oh. Be careful. These cookies are lickety slick. And Grinchy hates hugs. Better hide from them quick. When cookies come searching to give Grinch a hug, hide in the wardrobe, snug as a bug. Hide the Grinch. Great job hiding the Grinch. Come out, Grinch. The cookies 
nearby love to hug girls and boys. Slink by and stay silent. Don't make any noise. Jump in and you'll land in another location. Ha! What a great Grinchy jump! Ha. Rope to Candy Cane Lasso. can launch Grinchy up to new heights. Hop right on top, and then have a good flight. Ha! Before you keep going, before one step more, what's that? It's a path that you'll want to explore. Use the candy cane lasso. Hey. 
Use the candy cane lasso. Oh. Oh. Mm. Oh. Jump over these bats to get them to shoot, or dodge and avoid them to make your way through. Another locked door. You know how it goes, and you've done it before. You need Max to help Grinchy open this door. to the platform to avoid getting poked. Ha 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 ha. 
Aha! There are two different paths to make this journey complete. Use the ropes to climb up, or continue by feet. Ha! Oh! Ha! Ha! Oh! Secret area found! Oh. Ha. Ha. Oh. Oh. A cave full of dangers with spikes that can poke. You'll want to avoid them. The points are no joke. Going before one step more. What's that? It's a path oh. that you'll want to explore. Ha! You found puzzle pieces you simply want more. Well, look, there's a puzzle piece behind this door. As simple as pudding, all sugary rich. Max can pick up the pieces if he presses the switch. Ha! Ha! Jump from the rope to Candy Cane Lasso. Ha!
Getting cold, the wind's getting blowy, the exit is near, and the way out is snowy. Ha! Max can enter through the hole above the door. <coughs> well done. Use the candy cane lasso. Use the candy cane. Ah! <laughs> 
the wind on your chin and the chill in the air in no time old Grinch you'll be out of this lair ha 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 oh. ha Ha! Huh. Steal Christmas and time's moving fast. With a hatred so deep and a feeling so vile, the thought of no Christmas makes old Grinchy smile. Whatever the reason, his heart or his shoes, he stood there on Christmas Eve, hating the Who's. 
staring down from his cave with a sour, grinchy frown at the warm, lighted windows below in their town. For he knew every who down in Whoville beneath was busy now hanging a mistletoe wreath. And they're hanging their stockings, he snarled with a sneer. Tomorrow is Christmas, it's practically here. Then he growled with his Grinch fingers nervously drumming. I must find some way to stop Christmas from coming. For tomorrow he knew. All the Who girls and boys would wake bright and early. They'd rush for their toys and then, oh the noise, oh the noise, 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 noise. That's one thing he hated, the noise, 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 noise. Then the Who's, young and old, would sit down to a feast. And they'd feast, and they'd feast, and they'd feast, 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 feast. They would feast on Who pudding and rare Who roast beast, which was something the Grinch couldn't stand in the least. Now out of his cave on his snowboard at last, with an avalanche coming, Grinch needs to move fast! something he liked least of all. Every who down in Whoville, the tall and the small, would stand close together with Christmas bells ringing. They'd stand hand in hand and the who's would start singing. They'd sing and they'd sing and they'd sing, 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 sing. And the more the Grinch thought of this who Christmas sing, the more the Grinch thought, I must stop this whole thing. Why, for 53 years, i put up with it now. I must stop this Christmas from coming. But how? And he got an idea. An awful idea. The Grinch got a wonderful, awful idea. It's hard to control how to move on this ice. If Grinch slips the wrong way, he'll pay a steep price. Ha! Ah! 
Ha! 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 Grinch would rather be covered in ten dozen bugs. In true Grinchy nature, he hates who he hugs. Better hide him from who's and their love buggy tugs.
Aha! Oh. Just dangle. It looks like it swings. Hey. 
Aha! Oh. Hmm.
Don't stick the landing. It's back to the start. Ha! Ah! 
Ha!
Oh. Ha.
Aha. joke. Stick to the platform to avoid getting poked. These platforms are tricky, as you will discover. Use the candy cane lasso to swing from one to another. Uh -huh. 
I know just what to do. The Grinch laughed in his throat, and he made a quick Santa Claus hat and a coat. And he chuckled and clucked, what a great Grinchy trick. With this coat and this hat, I look just like St. Nick. All I need is a reindeer. The Grinch looked around. But since reindeer are scarce, there was none to be found. Did that stop the old Grinch? No, the Grinch simply said. If I can't find a reindeer, I'll make one instead. So he called his dog, Max. And he took some red thread, and he tied a big horn on the top of his head. Then he loaded some bags and some old empty sacks on a ramshackle sleigh, and he hitched up old Max. Then the Grinch said, get up! And the sleigh started down toward the homes where the Who's lay a snooze in their town. All the windows were dark. Quiet snow filled the air. All the hoos were all dreaming, sweet dreams without care. And he came to the first of the house on the square. This is stop number one, the old Grinchy Claws hissed. And he climbed to the roof, empty bags in his fist. While the Grinch is getting closer to Whoville at last, there's more cheer to avoid, and you've got to move fast! Then he slid down the chimney, a rather tight pinch. But if Santa could do it, then so could the Grinch. He got stuck only once for a moment or two. Then he stuck his head out of the fireplace flue, where the little Who's stockings all hung in a row. These stockings, he grinned, are the first things to go. Then he slithered and slunk, with a smile most unpleasant around the whole room, and he took every present. Pop guns and bicycles, roller skates, drums, checkerboards, tricycles, popcorn, and plums. And he stuffed them in bags. Then the Grinch very nimbly stuffed all the bags one by one up the chimney. Then he slunk to the icebox. He took the Who's Feast, he took the Who pudding, he took the roast beast. He cleaned out that icebox as quick as a flash. Why, that Grinch even took their last can of Who hash. And he 
stuffed all the food up the chimney with glee. And now, grinned the Grinch, I will stuff up the tree. hears their carols, his ears will start ringing. With hatred for music, he's made it quite clear. Hop over the notes, and they'll disappear. Ha! Through chimneys and windows, ha! Grinch moves ha! like a snake. <laughs> to homes full of presents with so much to take. Mm. You better move quick, mm. you don't want to be caught. Snatch up all presents. Now give it a shot. Uh -huh. Ha! Ha!
Beware Christmas stockings, the Grinch hates them so. Avoid them by jumping to make them all go. It's a trickety splickety tangled up dance. You can also cross through them whenever you get a chance. Ha! 
it to try. As it starts falling, run away! Then jump right over to get by. Knock down the Christmas tree. In order to get past this top of the tree, Use the jetpack. Uh-huh. <laughs> 
Ha ha! Grinch, or you'll get squashed right over!
the jet
falling from a pipe. Dodge them by jumping over them or use the jetpack. Be brave and jump, jump, jump. grabbed the tree and he started to shove when he heard a small sound like the coo of a dove he turned around fast and he saw a small who little Cindy Lou who who was not more than two the Grinch had been caught by this tiny who daughter who would got out of bed for a cup of cold water she stared at the Grinch and said Santa Claus why why are you taking our Christmas tree why but you know, that old Grinch was so smart and so slick. He thought up a lie, and he thought it up quick. Why, my sweet little tot, the fake Santa Claus lied. There's a light on this tree that won't light on one side. So I'm taking it home to my workshop, my dear. I'll fix it up there, then I'll bring it back here. And his fib fooled the child. Then he patted her head, and he got her a drink, and he sent her to bed. And when Cindy Lou Who went to bed with her cup, he went to the chimney and stuffed the tree up. Then the last thing he took was the log for their fire. Then he went up the chimney himself, the old liar. On their walls, he left nothing but books and some wine. And the one speck of food that he left in the house was a crumb that was even too small for a mouse.
Then he did the same thing to the other Who's houses, leaving crumbs much too small for the other Who's mouses. It was quarter past dawn, all the Who's still abed, all the Who's still a snooze when he packed up his sled. Packed it up with their presents, the ribbons, the wrappings, the tags, and the tinsel, the trimmings, the trappings. 3,000 feet up, up the side of Mount Crumpet, he rode with his load to the tip top to dump it. Poop poo to the Who's, he was grinchishly humming. They're finding out now that no Christmas is coming. They're just waking up, I know just what they'll do. Their mouths will hang open a minute or two. Then the Who's down in Whoville will all cry boo hoo. Christmas is coming. Get on with the theft. It's time to steal presents so nothing is left.
That's a noise, grinned the Grinch, that I simply must hear. So he paused, and the Grinch put his hand to his ear. And he did hear a sound rising over the snow. It started in low, then it started to grow. But the sound wasn't sad. Why, this sound sounded merry. It couldn't be so, but it was merry, very. He stared down at Uther. The Grinch popped his eyes, then he shook. What he saw was a shocking surprise.
Down in Whoville, the tall and the small was singing without any presents at all. He hadn't stopped Christmas from coming. It came. Somehow or other, it came just the same. And the Grinch with his Grinch feet ice cold in the snow stood puzzling and puzzling. How could it be so? It came without ribbons. It came without tags. It came without packages, boxes, or bags. And he puzzled three hours till his puzzler was sore. Then the Grinch thought of something he hadn't before. Maybe Christmas, he thought, doesn't come from a store. Maybe Christmas, perhaps, means a little bit more. And what happened then? Well, in Whoville they say that the Grinch's small heart grew three sizes that day. And the minute his heart didn't feel quite so tight, he whizzed with his load through the bright morning light, and he brought back the toys and the food for the feast. And he... With this change of his heart, Grinch knows just what to do. He will give back the presents to every sweet who. Better than gold, diamonds, silver, or pearls is returning all presents to the Who boys and girls. You can return all of the presents you collected on your adventures in Whoville. Try to return them all. Thank <laughs> you. 
He himself, the Grinch, carved the roast beast. Thank you.